We're back in the Kansas City Live Kitchen with another look at Restaurant Week. Joining me now, Kelly Manning from Tavern Mission Farms. And Kelly, this food smells amazing once again. We're so excited for you. How's it? You've, you guys have been participating in Restaurant Week since you opened, right? Yes, we opened Tavern in the Village five years ago this February. And then we've also been open up at Tavern and Mission Farms for about three and a half years. And we participated ever since. Good for you. A couple of the items you brought, this pan-seared char. Yes. Uh, tell us, uh, obviously, a fish. Yes. And uh, how do you prepare it? Um, char is a great fish. It's in the salmon family, but it also acts like a trout. So it's mm -hmm. a trout that thinks it's a salmon. Mm -hmm. um, it's got that beautiful pink color, just like salmon does. Mm -hmm. A little bit more mild, but a wonderful, delicate, white or uh, flaky fish, and uh, it's just delicious. Wonderful. Okay, so. Uh, so we're just going to put a little salt and a little pepper on it to season it. The oil is hot. The oil is hot. Want to make sure it's always hot. That's in the really pan. key, isn't it? It is. That way you get a nice sear on it, the outside mm -hmm. of it. And so put it down in there. Okay. How many minutes each side? Um, you probably want to go about three or four minutes on each side. Right. You want to be very careful not to overcook it, obviously. Mm -hmm. um, but Look at those beautiful colors. Is, it really is. And the fish is just really healthy for you. Yes. It's got so many great omega. Um, vitamins, omega, mm -hmm. everything else. Yeah. And then next to it is the butternut, butternut squash. Um, this is a sweet potato. Sweet potato yes. puree. Yes. So we've got the sweet potato puree. And this is great. We put a little bit of thyme in it also. And then there's some cream and butter just to make sure it's delicious. You have to put the cream and but butter in it. Everybody and loves sweet potatoes. That looks amazing. This Good. is another one of our dishes. We have three different dishes that we serve at dinner. And this is our osabuco. Mm -hmm. And it is a pork osabuco. Mm. And it really is delicious. We uh, slow oven roast it. Yes. It's got a wonderful. Uh, um, Tomato demi glaze that we put over the top, and then some fresh roasted vegetables. It looks like it's just going to fall off the bone. Yes. So, so I know you're going to flip there. Yep. And uh, we'll finish products over there at the end of the table. Are you doing just the dinner then? We're doing lunch and dinner. Okay. For lunch, we've got a tilapia dish that we're serving, and then our wonderful uh, award winning burger. And we top it uh, out at Mission Farms with cheddar cheese and bacon. And then in the village, we've got some onions and uh, mushrooms that we put over the top. And, and how are you guys doing as far as uh, capacity and reservations? Definitely reservations are suggested. It's a great week, I think, for the entire city. Uh, yeah. Great 10 days, I should say. But last night was the beginning, and it was the kickoff, and it was fantastic. We had a wonderful lunch at both places and a wonderful dinner. Awesome. And it helps so many great organizations in Kansas City. Sure does. And so it's a great way to get people out, um, seeing some restaurants maybe that they haven't seen before. And then also... Um, Supporting the community at the same time. Absolutely. Kelly Manning, thank you so much for coming in from Tavern, two locations, the Village and Mission Farms. I like the vino at the end. Very nice presentation. Thank all you around. so much. We appreciate it. And uh, yeah, if you can support them, you also support local charities. And while you plate that up, I will just uh, go ahead and throw it back to Richard. Thank you so much. Yeah, it thank you. Please.